welcome to my channel and welcome to today's video now take a look at these these are some potato how many you're watching like potatoes I like potatoes I like a good mashed potato but you know what I also like I like to use potato on my skin and why is that so because it's contain an ingredient known as catecholase that's when chill have to lighten brighten the skin but also potato starch have to live tighten and firm the skin oh my goodness did you know the potato could do so much for the skin topically if not guess what guys I am gonna share a recipe with you using the potato and you might call this Irish you might call it white potato whatever you call it it is the same potato potato whatever so we're gonna use it guys to make a facial wash that can be double as an eye treatment for puffy eyes eye pads dark under eye circles you're gonna use it for that area but you can use it all over your face your neck and your decollete to clear pigmentation so what are you waiting for let's get in the kitchen and start whipping it up and also at the end I'm gonna give you some tips and how to get the best result from using the potato on your skin for this recipe you're gonna need a small bowl you're also gonna need a small blender and let's take a look at our ingredients my first ingredient is gonna be potato and also known as Irish potato or white potato we're using the potato because it contains catecholase which when chill will have to clear hyperpigmentation on the skin one medium potato we're also gonna be using some milk in this recipe and today I'm using fresh milk use milk or soy milk or almond milk if you do not want to use the fresh milk we're also also going to be using some aloe vera gel and we have two oils here we have our cucumber seed oil and we also have the kiwi oil you can use either or either or you can use both or you can also choose to use any of your favorite oil to replace the cucumber seed and the kiwi oil now for this recipe I have one optional ingredient which is witch hazel you can choose to use it or you can choose to leave it out so the first thing I'm gonna do I'm gonna peel the potato get rid of the outer peel of the potato now once the potato is peeled take a look this is what it looks like next I'm gonna chop the potato in small pieces for easier blending so go ahead and chop if you have a powerful blender no need to chop now that the potato is chopped we're gonna place the potato in my blender there we have the potato in the blender and next we're gonna reach for the milk we're gonna use about three tablespoons of milk so we're just gonna pour this in the blender about three tablespoons and next I'm gonna use the cucumber seed oil and for the cucumber seed oil I'm gonna be using about a, a teaspoon of the cucumber seed oil want to go ahead and pour this in one teaspoon of the cucumber seed oil I'm also going to use a bit of my kiwi oil. Remember, you can use one or you can use both or you can completely leave it out. And I'm using about a half a teaspoon of that kiwi oil for my optional ingredient, which is the witch hazel. I'm going to pour about a teaspoon of the witch hazel oil. And then we're going to cover, shake it up like that. And then we are going to blend. Now after blending, take a look. We're gonna now strain. So let's go ahead and strain. You can also use a cheesecloth to strain this. Pour everything out. Another amazing way you could use this recipe is all over your face for dark spots and blemishes. And now take a look. Here we have our mixer, nice and creamy. However, we have one final ingredient that we're going to use in this, and that's the aloe vera gel. We're going to use about a, a teaspoon of the aloe vera gel, which I like to add at the end, not before. And now we are just going to mix this in. And this is going to cause this mixture to be more of a gel-like consistency. This is exactly how you want it to be, totally dissolving the aloe vera gel in the mix. So let's recap the ingredient in this remedy. We have some potato. We also have some milk. 
we have some witch hazel we have some cucumber seed oil and some kiwi oil and also some aloe vera gel and now the remedy is ready however before we use this we like to chill it to activate that catecholase from the potato so let's just pour this and there is your remedy right there place it in the refrigerator for about an hour let it chill and now it is ready to use on your skin store the leftovers in the refrigerator and use it up within seven days and here it is guys take a look at this this is the mixture right here now to use this on the skin you're gonna need some applicator and these are cotton pads use q-tips or any applicator that you have now to use this as a dark circle remover a eye bag a puffy eye remover you are just going to soak that cotton pad and a little goes a long way and you are going to dab it under your eyes you're dabbing it on the clean under eyes so go ahead and dab this on and you're going to do both under eyes with it now once this is done you are going to leave it on the skin you can go to sleep with it once it is dried and you're going to use it for at least a six weeks straight after a week or so you should notice a significant difference but what I like most about this guys is that this can use all over your face so you can go ahead and always remember to shake it up and you can soak that cotton pad like I'm showing here and you are going to apply this all over your face and yes you can be generous with it apply it all over your face is gonna lighten brighten clear hyperpigmentation and guess what you can do with this again guys you can let it dry on the skin or you can also use this as a facial wash so you can soak up your cotton pad with it and you can go ahead and wash your face with it wash your face with it and this one works like a charm you're looking for fast result wash your face with this twice per day a.m. and p.m. and you're on your way to naturally glowing skin just a very versatile versatile remedy that can clear dark on the eye circles eye bags and puffy eyes can get rid of spots and blemishes on the skin it can also help your skin to look younger fresher and brighter and it can also give you that natural glow so what are you waiting for you need to get in your kitchen really really quick and start whipping this one up and guess what I want you all to do is to take a before and after picture use it for at least six weeks straight and then come back and leave a comment or share your picture store this one in the refrigerator one more thing I forget to tell you when you use this on the skin and you leave it on the skin like now I'm feeling a tightening sensation that is coming from the potato so guess what it also have to tighten and firm the skin it's a recipe that you really should try if you're skeptical about any other recipe that I made in this channel this one is a must try so go ahead whip it up use it up and then come back and leave a comment thank you all for watching and I'll see you all in my next video bye, -bye.